Hey guys, Caden here today with another episode of Minecraft Wildlife Park, as I have now decided to name this series. Congratulations myself, I came up with a series name. I'm so original. Anyway guys, we are back with a new episode and, well, you guys suggested quite a few mods. Now I'm going to say, um, I'm actually, yeah I got an iron axe by the way, I think I traded it with one of the villagers down there for it. Anyway, I'm going to quickly, just, I don't know, mod options doesn't show this. I'm going to hit T real quick. I'm going to open up my mods folder, and I'm going to show you, tell you guys all the new mods we have. We have Animals Plus. We have Dragon Mounts. We have Extra Utilities. We have Lots of Mobs. Minecraft Comes Alive. We got, oh, what? I can't remember which mod that is. There's, I got a core for mod. And I think we may have gotten one more. I can't remember which one, though. Um... I did, did try and get all the ones you guys did suggest, um, which included, I believe, if I move my window over a bit, um, Tropicraft, no, I had that one, Tropicraft, I had to remove because it didn't work anymore, um, I, Mine Factory didn't work properly with all the other mods, and neither did Aquatic Abyss, which is unfortunate, so we may have lost out on the ability to get uh, Swordfish and Marlins in the zoo, which is kind of unfortunate, I'm going to see if I can get them to work because I'd really love to have those mods back in the world. So anyway guys, some big news before we get on to the main part of the episode, which we'll be doing one of the things you guys did suggest I do, and that is, we hit 500 subscribers last night guys, we hit 500 subscribers, and that is awesome. I want to thank you guys a ton for that, um, I, I'm, gonna, I'm planning a special episode out, um, I mentioned this in my last episode of Dinosaurs, which is which was yesterday. Um, basically, I want to know what you guys want me to do for a 500 subscriber special. We've had some ideas. Some people have suggested I do a go. I open up my own public dinosaur server, which sorry guys, probably isn't going to happen. Maybe we could go on a public dino server. Someone suggested maybe I do a long stream on Saturday or something. I do a long dino stream or something to celebrate. Um, I had, I've been, I, this was kind of an idea based off a suggestion. Maybe we go on Mineplex and I'll create a, a private, um, like, not library, a private little group and we can all come on. Maybe I'll live stream it. Anyway, we can all come on and we can all play some mini games together. You guys play with me. Um, I'll probably record one or two of the matches so that way, you know, you guys have a chance to end up on the channel. Maybe we'll do some shout outs, things like that, if we do that option. Um, someone suggested I do a parody, and I don't know if they mean like a music parody or something of dinos. I'm not sure. Uh, I think someone suggested maybe I do a, an animation or something to celebrate. I'm not sure. You guys have given me some good ideas. I'd love to have some more so we get a, I can get a really good idea of how you guys want me to celebrate us reaching 500 subscribers. Because, I mean, that's that's pretty good. We're halfway to 1,000. <laughs> That's a number I didn't think I was going to reach so soon. I mean, if this keeps up, who knows? Maybe we'll hit 1,000 by the end of the year. That'd be pretty awesome, guys. That would be amazing. So, yeah, that if you were wondering what the next goal on the channel is, that is the next goal, 1,000 subscribers. But, anyway, enough rambling on about the whole 500 subscribers, although that's a pretty big thing. Let's get on to what today's episode is going to be. So, yeah, I got a lot of suggestions for stuff to do, but one of the ones that did seem to be quite uh, prevalent was to build an elephant enclosure. So, if you look at my inventory, you will see I have acacia wood. Because I'm going to build... Eh, you guys will probably have seen this style of fence before. Um, By the way, while I'm talking, I'm just going to quickly dig out this area so that way it's a bit better and ready to be made into the desert outpost home. Because I don't know if we're going to be building... Oh, I didn't know we had that biome over there. Huh. What do you know? Maybe we can build the zoo here. I don't know. So I'm thinking, guys, we may not end up having just one house. I'm thinking we may end up having maybe two or three, depending on what biomes we can find. Because I'm thinking of naming this the Desert Savanna Outpost. So, like, if we can get a teleporter, a mod that adds teleporters in, or maybe I'll just get a mini-map mod that allows me to teleport around the map by, via waypoints... Um, maybe th we would just keep this house as kind of like whenever we need to go get a desert or savanna type animal, we can come here and grab them with the golden lassos and then we can leave and go back to the main zoo. I don't know. That was just an idea. I don't know if you guys are all that interested in me making tons of little bases all over the place. 
But yeah, since we don't have golden lassos yet and we can't just pick an elephant up and store it, I figure we can probably make a little bit of an enclosure for one for now. Now, uh, there are actually two elephants nearby. The problem is both of them are fully grown, so we will have to, unfortunately, I think you tame fully grown ones with cake, which I don't have, and those boars are mean. They attack me every time, I cry every time. So I'm gonna quickly build a bit of a, no, you, you stay. Okay, you have to stay in an area, Mr. Elephant, so I can build up this cage around you. Let's see. Because if I do... Actually, I don't even need to put them up too high. It could even just be like this, and it won't be able to get up above them. And I can put them one block apart because obviously the elephant's hitbox is too big for it to go through one block spaces. So this is gonna be just a temporary little place to put it in until, while well, I build the main enclosure onto this. No. Sorry, sorry, but I need. <sighs> okay, we're gonna try that again. We're gonna try it again because you know what? The first you don't succeed, you try again. But if you get mauled by an elephant multiple times, you might just give up because you know what? Elephants are kind of mean. Okay, we gotta get him trapped in there. We can do this. We can do this. Just gotta grab all the supplies. Also, what mod is this from? The crystal ball, I don't know. Come here, come in here. Come in here, Mr. Elephant. We need you to go in. Let's go. Come on. Oh, I think we're going to die again. Oh. Yes, we caught it. We caught the elephant. <laughs> He's not happy about it, though. Oh, well, we caught an elephant, guys. Also, let's go check out the village, because I did, like I said, I added in Minecraft Comes Alive, so there should be some new villagers here. Yep, we got, like, a guard there. We got, oh, yeah, this is where everyone was the first time I came over here. We got you, Becca the Mason. We got Diane the guard. Hello. Um, I don't have a horse anymore. Oi, oi, who said I look scary? Wow. That's... Hmm. Pearl. Oh. Well, oh, that's not a crystal ball. Okay, so those guys must have been added in by, what is it? Ocean Craft, which is one of the mods we have installed. Okay, that's interesting. Well, that's kind of lagging my game, all that text popping up there. Well, let's see, are you still mad at me? Yep, you're still mad at me. I think we're gonna have to let him kill us. So that way we, he, we, okay, good. That's unfortunate that we had to die a couple times, but you know what, it's worth it. It's worth it if we get an elephant out of the deal. It's worth it. So actually I'm going, after we get down there again, I'm gonna quickly open up the wiki page for Mo Creatures and I'm gonna see what I need to actually tame this guy. So that way we can maybe make it a bit easier on ourselves. Okay, hello, dude. Um, okay, so I'm just gonna put <laughs> chat there because that's the easiest thing to do in single player when I want to pause the game. Um, so let's see, Mo Creatures Elephant. Elephant Taming. Let's see, Elephants and Mammoths. Uh, appearance, Generation, Behavior. Taming. The tame an elephant, you need to right click a baby elephant or calf with 10 tamed elephants and mammoths. Um, oh, can you not tame fully grown elephants? Um, once you have an elephant, the uh, name should. Oh, okay, so we can't actually re um, tame this dude. 
I wonder if you can breed them, because I know there's another elephant out there. So we could potentially breed a baby and give it sugar lumps, which I'll figure out how to craft. I have NEI installed, so like, there we go. NEI installed, so that way we can actually set, so that way we can actually check how we are supposed to make sugar lumps to feed a baby elephant. Because it'd be kind of cool to have more than one elephant. I plan on making maybe a small herd of maybe four or so elephants. Since they're not... Hey, are they pretty... I think they're a bit smaller than real life elephants are. So we can obviously put more than one in an enclosure. Probably gonna... Yeah, like I said, I'll probably put four or five in an enclosure. And I think that'll be pretty good. So let's see... Is that how you spell sugar? Oh, sugar lumps. Yeah, there we go. Okay, sugar... Sugar lump. For... Oh. Wow, how many did it say it would eat? Ten. That's a lot of sugar. Um, let's see. Can you breed these guys? Um... Does not look. Oh yeah, I forgot they had mammoths in. Song, Songwa River Mammoth. Interesting. Equipment trivia. Does not appear to be able to be bred. That may be a problem. Okay, so it does not look. Okay, yeah. So the golden lasso is definitely going to need to be. Is definitely going to be a lot more useful. But we can't get those until we go to the Nether because we need Eyes of Ender to be able to tame not tame to make a golden lasso unless i guess you can find them in like a i don't know what would you find them in dungeons i guess we'll see anyway i'm running out of food i'm gonna head over to the village real quick we'll grab some food and then i guess we'll figure out what to do i don't really have a plan yet for how i want the zoo to go because i haven't decided if this is going to be the final area for the zoo i'd kind of is that a mole Yeah, that's a mole. I think that's added in by one of the other animal mods I put in. There are a lot of animal mods. Okay, there are a lot of moles. Yeah, that's a mole. <laughs> we have a mole! There are a lot of animal mods, but I still think by far, um, what is this mod? Mo Creatures is the best, just in terms of quality. The animals look much nicer, I think, personally, than uh, most of the other mods. But they don't have as many as some of the other mods do. Turkey! My hello there. Turkey! Oh, I want to save the duck. We're going to save a good deal of these animals, hopefully to try and eventually capture them and make them exhibits in our zoo. Or our wildlife park. I don't know what it is right now. Right now, it's just a little hole in a mountain with an elephant in an acacia log, like, holding pen. <laughs> 10 out of 10 would visit again. <laughs> oh, we have, I have a weird zoo. Oh, boy. We're getting lots of comments. That is actually one of the insane things. I just want to mention this real quick, guys. So, what is this? Bef like, two weeks ago, or let's just say before the explosion of the channel when it got I started getting a bit bigger on YouTube. I was getting maybe two to five comments a video, and this was not every video, so you know, it was just a bit, a few comments here, a few comments there, you know, pretty simple stuff, right? And now, I mean, my videos are barely up for a day, and they're getting like 40 comments, and I'm like, whoa, what is happening? Because, I mean, it's a bit of a shock going <laughs> from like four comments on every other video to suddenly like, oh yeah, you're just getting like 40 comments a video. So, you know, yeah. I'm glad though that you guys are commenting a ton. It's pretty awesome to get all the support from you guys. Pretty awesome fans. Oh, are you? No, you're not a babby. Are you an Asian elephant? You might be an Asian elephant. In which case, I'm gonna quickly check. I still have the wiki page up. Um, what do the Asian elephants look like? Yep, that is an Asian elephant. Okay. 
There is only one way, one foreseeable way to bring this thing over to the cage. Is it chewing faster than I am? No. Is that a piranha? That's a piranha. I don't like piranhas. I'm a piranha. They live in the Amazon. Come on, elephant. Da -da 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 -da. Look out, everyone. Wild elephant. Wild, angry elephant. <laughs> Coming through. Oh, boy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good elephant. Good angry elephant. <laughs> Trying to murder me. Run. It definitely sounds angry. Ugh. Uh. Ugh. Mm. Now where did I build the cage? Or the holding pen? It sounds better when I call it the holding pen. It doesn't sound as cruel. <laughs> Where's the cage? Oh, there's the cage. Holding pen. Holding pen. Is my other elephant mad at me now? Whew. And there we go, guys. We have captured ourselves two elephants. And I don't. Ah, oh, we can have to. You know, what? first we're gonna put a little bit of extra precaution in, in case. Well, there we. Go. Just so that way we can assure that they will not escape from this place, we will put down some fences because you know what, fences are amazing. Ah. That elephant, you don't attack me. I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to save you from extinction. Because you know what? I'm amazing. And there we go. We have capture ourselves two elephants. And I really don't have any other plans for this episode right now. So I think we are going to end it here. If you guys have some name suggestions for the elephants, please leave those in the comments below. Sorry if this is a shorter episode than I intended it to be. Um, there just really isn't that much to do right now. We need to really set the zoo up, get lassos and stuff so we can really bring elephants places and stuff. Next, if you have any suggestions for what I should do next episode, be it start preparing the ele the actual elephant enclosure, because this isn't going to be the final one. I can assure you guys of that. So maybe, do you guys want me to build the first elephant enclosure, which I think will be just in this surrounding area here? Do we build a new enclosure? Do we capture new animals? I don't know. What do you guys want to see? Well, anyway, guys, thank you again for watching. I hope you did all enjoy this episode. If you did, make sure to hit that like button down below. And until next time, guys, see ya!